I am moving to university today and I can't believe it. I've been up since 7.30 this morning and I did set an alarm. I stayed at Connor's, I came home straight away and I don't know how to feel. What do you do when we get there? What do you do then? When I'm like, when my stuff's moved in, what? what, what? I kind of want to do a post on Instagram, like, point of view, last week at home track. Because um, I've took some cute photos. I've tried to take photos of all the stuff I've done this week. Um, so I might do that in a minute. I just can't believe it. So, here's my outfit of the day. I actually came on my period this morning. Really good. So I have this top on from Zara. My Strad... My Strad Colotte and then my sliders. But I'm going to put on... I'm going to take my Air Force with me to put on when we get there. And I've got a glass of water. How do you feel on a scale of 1 to 10? 10. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Mother tracker. It just jumps now to me being moved into uni because I cry. I didn't even cry. It was just like, it was just like loads to do. So I didn't vlog anything whilst moving my stuff in. So it's like a complete jump. I'm in. And um, it's so weird. But there's definitely people in the kitchen next to me. There's no one speak. Let me go into my bed. Wait there. Yeah, I literally didn't vlog anything because it's kind of stressful to be honest. But anyway, it's still like seven o'clock and I've been here since half one. My mum and dad left about four probably. Lives three, like is upstairs, two staircases. So we went for food. We're not going out tonight because Liv thinks she got spiked yesterday. So we're just going to chill, but I'm currently in my room chilling. She's in her room chilling. Um, I did come down to make friends. And I'm not knocking the I'm not knocking doors. I'm not doing that. Um, I thought there was gonna be people in the kitchen, but there's not. Like it just feels so weird. I feel like we've been waiting for this day for like literally months. We literally have, and I just feel like it's so weird. That I'm here like in uni. Like I can't. I don't. I don't go home now. Like I'm not going. Like imagine I never move back home. Like imagine like this is me like for life. Like imagine like it's so weird. Like I'm so freaked out about it. Um, but yeah, we went to Juno Lounge. And that's about it. Tomorrow we're gonna go to the gym. Um, we're gonna try our run JDs to see if we like it. But I don't think we will because we're so used to our gym. Morning! Um, I really don't like this. It is the most weirdest thing ever. And I think I just wanna go home. Like, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna go do a food shop. <sighs> Strokes, man. It's not very fun, to be honest. Um, me and Liv just did our first ever uni shop. And mine came. Sorry, we're going to go. Liv, come in my vlog. Hers was 37 pounds. I'm not really sure what she bought, to be honest. So, here's my haul. I've got everything I've got from the Future. First thing I got was a bag, obviously. I got a pizza, which is hella squished. Um, I got some Cornettos, which need to go right in the freezer. Um, I got some wraps, which I'll probably freeze first. Some straws, some lettuce, um, some blueberries. Pepper and some cucumber. I got this ready meal pie thing. I got a ready made cottage pie. I got some chorizo, some chicken breasts, and some chicken sausages, some bagels, some chicken seasoning, two protein yogurt. They have loads of those, those ones, which I've shopped at. Some micro rice, some tampons, a broccoli, some salsa, and a potato. That's all I bought in my shop. And it's 25 pounds, which I thought was quite good. And now, like, will be meals for, like, the whole week, um, which I thought was really good. Morning, I'm awake. I don't know how my spring because there's literally no one next door to me. But I've just woke up. Well, I've come like an hour ago. Um, and Connor's coming to visit me because.
because I forgot my retainer. So he's bringing it to me. How am I going to go out? Because I don't start even until tomorrow. But anyway, I'm awake. It's like 20 past 10. I'm desperate for a week, so I'm going to go to the toilet. And yeah, I had a really good night's nice sleep. It's actually so comfortable in my bed. But I keep getting bad dreams that there's mold on my wall, <laughs> even though it's not. Also, I ordered a MacBook um, and I didn't think I'd ordered it because the money hasn't come out of my account yet. Um, but it came out of my account this morning, so that's exciting. It's going to come hopefully like this week. So when I go home, I can bring it back with me. But I also don't know if I show you this, but my auntie got me this really cute thing because you have to do the 40 babies before you can qualify. And they come with sticky on feet, and every baby you deliver, you stick. The feet on and if it's a boy you do a purple one if it's a girl you put a pink one and, and yeah i thought that was really really cute um, um oh i definitely will do a room tour but i think i'm gonna do that like for another video to be honest because yeah and i can't believe i'm actually starting tomorrow i'm quite nervous to begin like the actual tour so it's a bit scary but it's kind of just induction so it's not that scary because it's just like what we know well, it's not what we know, but like it'll just be like getting to know other people and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, put a pen in here for when I do start. Um, but I'm excited to start. Yeah, I'm gonna get dressed now. I'm just gonna chuck on the track so I've got to get an iron because my clothes are all so free. Um, so I'm gonna text them and add that to the list of what to buy next weekend when I'm home. So I'm ready. My hair has gone quite curly to be fair. Um it's just annoying like when it's windy and it's also absolutely boiling. So I'm currently I've got a white sweat on. But anyway, I've got the green bar tracksuit on, obviously. Um and yeah, I'm just waiting now for him to come. And also I was meant to get my loan today, but I haven't come in yet, which is really annoying. Um, and I'm gonna have to have a shower later, but the shower here. Guys, I can't even explain, it is gross. I'm gonna have to do later because I didn't shower yesterday, I just found washed um, because I couldn't do it. But I actually live well in the shower yesterday and she said it wasn't too bad. I also, also before I came, got some metal straws. So here they are, look how cool they come. But I didn't bring a big enough glass to use the, put the metal straws in. So Colin is bringing me a pint glass today for my house so then I can use the metal straws there's like eight in here and they come with cleaners which i thought was cool but yeah i'll let you know i'm gonna get here i'm gonna go and i've got a cup to clean so i'm gonna go and put my shoes on and i go and clean the cup who i'm with hey guys he just missed me too much even though he's not seen me for two days that's it that's where he just had to come and see me We've had the cutest date day. We went for a Costa, we went to mini golf, and we got a Diet Coke from Five Guys. And now I'm going home. I'm gonna show up in my room and then he's gonna go home and then I'm gonna see him in four days so it doesn't even matter. Yay! But it's absolutely boring. I should not have worn this. I'm gonna go home and change. I'm gonna keep the joggers on, but I'm gonna take this jumper out straight off. So I'm obviously back now. I've had lunch with Liv and a few of the other girls, which is really nice, but I am knackered. I came on my period, I can't remember if I said the day that I came here, and it's my worst period I've ever had, and it's taken the life out of me. I am literally exhausted because I've been getting like 10 hours sleep, so it's definitely my period just taken out of me, and I'm so tired. But I'm just chilling in bed watching Gavin and Stacey. I'm on episode four. I'm gonna watch this for a bit and then probably read some of my book. And yeah, just chill, ready for tomorrow. I might do a face mask later. Um, and yeah, the absolute best thing I did was bring um a crate of coke. Diet Cafe Food, Diet Cokes with me to uni and on the weekend I'm gonna absolutely buy another crate to bring back with me. So I'm back in my dorm, well I'm back in my room and I want to go in the shower but it's so gross and I've been putting it off. I haven't had a shower, I didn't shower yesterday which is minging to be honest, absolutely gross so I'm gonna go in now but I'm just cringing because it's minging in there, like it's actually vile. 
like I can't explain how gross it is but the plan for tomorrow we're gonna get a gym membership and go to the gym after our lectures tomorrow which is exciting and yeah I think I'm gonna have an ice cream in a minute and maybe some cereal later but I don't know I'm boiling hey fuck so we had a really nice night in upstairs but to like I don't know one of the people's flats who are upstairs and we had a really good time but I'm really not enjoying myself have to ignore me i'm severely hungover right now but i'm editing this video and i wanted to keep this in because i think it shows realistically it is actually quite hard your first week of uni but like i thought i'd keep it in to show people like so people can relate to it even though i was like literally hysterically crying like get a grip rube but yeah i thought i'd keep it in for that reason and that reason only but don't worry guys i'm completely fine um i'm so tired i can't lie i literally cried myself to sleep last night it was not very fun. Like, I didn't enjoy myself. Why is it even black? I have the biggest headache right now. I feel rough as hell. Anyway, I'm gonna straighten my hair. Probably have some porridge for breakfast. Um. And yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna get dressed and go probably. Sorry, my alarm's off. Don't know about anyone else who's in halls right now. But if you like it, then give me some advice because I don't at all. It is literally the crack of dawn and I don't think there's anyone else awake on this whole campus. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna do my hair and then I'll speak to you later. I'm watching Gavin and Stacey. That was so harsh. Um, I need to shave and oil. I'm sorry, guys. But I've nearly finished series one, and I've literally been watching it for three days. So I don't know what I'm gonna watch once I finished it. Um, but I'm currently straightening my hair. It's like eight o'clock, so we have like an hour before we need to go. But I think we'll leave at quarter to eight, probably. I don't have my student ID. I think you were meant to go and pick it up, but I never went to get it. So, hopefully they let me in. They should do, because, like, loads of people wouldn't have them, surely. Also, look at all this baby hair. When I lost loads of weight, I, all my hair fell out, and now my front of all my hair is like this. And because I went blonde as well, it's all, like, broke. I was actually thinking, let me open this good. Mm, that's what she did I was actually thinking it's so crazy because I wanted to do midwifery for the longest time and I'm doing it now. Like I start today, I just can't, cannot quite believe it. I can't even believe that I'm doing this. I'm so excited, but apparently it's going to be really boring today. It's literally just inductions all day. So that is not gonna be very fun. I've just done my makeup. I don't have any mascara, so I need to borrow some of Liv's mascara. Um, and obviously put some lip gloss on, but I need to brush my teeth before I put lip gloss on. But yeah. This bedroom looks you so dehydrated. I might put some more bronzer on. I'm gonna do an outfit of the day for you. My hair is already gone curly, which are we shocked? No. Um, move out of the way. I have this Zara top on. These sh combat cargo combats. My mum calls them combats. No, I'm calling them combats. From Stradivarius. They make my bum look really nice. I've got some common just the the cons with the hearts on. And then I've also got this school bag, which is from Primani. We just had our first like lecture thing. It was like, um, like just going over the course and stuff. And it was really fun. And now we're back in the rooms, just having a little break. We have to go back in like 10 minutes. Liv's just gone upstairs to get herself some crisps. I'm just chilling in bed. Um, it was kind of boring and I forgot my water. And if you know me, then you know I like, I need water in my life. 
So it is 6 p.m. Um, I'm gonna take my makeup off. I don't really know what else to do. I'm currently watching Sophia and Chintia's birth vlog. I kind, pardon me. I kind of wish I had like work to do because obviously we could just like do some work, but I don't have any work to do. So it's just chilling. And we just had people come in from like the student union and they talked to us about like some rules and stuff, like what you can and can't do, just the obvious like stuff to be honest. But anyway, I'm gonna take my makeup off. I don't know if I'm gonna put makeup on tomorrow. And I don't know. I did want to walk around to Aldi, but the weather is absolutely disgusting. So I don't think I'm going to. But anyway, I'm gonna take my makeup off. I'm gonna wash my face. And then I will make some dinner. Um, I might have to watch a film or something because otherwise I'm going to be pretty bored. But yeah, also the lighting in this room is horrendous. And I did cry my mascara earlier down my face. I was on the face under my dad literally holding back tears. I was like, <laughs> um, but oh my God, my dad works abroad. He works in another country and he flew to Spain today. Um, not he doesn't work in Spain but he flew to Spain today to like he's working in Spain and the pilot had to do an emergency landing because of how bad the turbulence was and he went to land in where he was landing and he had to take off again because the turbulence was so bad and my dad said the man next to him was literally my dad literally doesn't get scared at anything like that would put, I would never fly again if that happened to me and he was like it was quite scary he was like the man next to him was literally like praying like crying praying and he thought like he wasn't gonna make it and I was he was like oh yeah but I'm going back on Thursday I was like if I was me I'd be walking back because I would literally never step foot on a plane again I don't know about anyone else or if that's really dramatic but that would push me over the edge to be honest and um, yeah I hope I sleep so much earlier than I literally could not sleep last night so I hope tonight I like fall asleep really early. Um, but I'm gonna try and read some of my book because I feel like I've watched too much YouTube. And yeah, I do need to take the bin down to the big bin. But I might do that tomorrow because it's meant to be sunny tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna pack. Well, I'm going home on Friday, um, which is exciting. So only three more sleeps and I can go home. So I've just been in the shower and um, I've got my outfit ready for tomorrow by here. Um, and yeah, it's about, I don't know what the time is. Let's have a look. Half eight, I wanna say. Yeah, just before half eight. So I'm gonna watch some YouTube probably, probably read some more of my book and just chill relax out so much which is really cool and really nice and really good just spraying some febreze i also forgot my hair gel because my biggest fear is this room smelling because when you go outside like the kitchen that smells but anyway i'm dressed i can do that for the day if you want i am doing out for the days over on tiktok so don't follow my tiktok i'm gonna brush my teeth um so here's my outfit of the day. Jeans are from Primark, belt is also from Primark. Jewelry, Pandora, 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 Etsy. Top is pretty little thing, which is really see-through. Got my cons on and then my school bag, which is actually really cute. It was 11 pounds, it was from Primark and I love it. I'll probably also wear my Zara jacket because it's a bit chilly, I can't lie. I think I'm gonna invest in a nice coat. Uh, this bag, I love it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna invest in a nice coat. I also need to remember my water bottle, so I'm gonna take this and put it in the fridge for my lunch. I am, I just had lunch. I don't know if I vlogged this morning. Hey, it is Wednesday. Oh, I actually did. I vlogged in that little thing that we just had me and Liv. I just filmed me and Liv like this. Um, Watching Evan and Stacey, I'm on series two, episode three. I'm running through the episodes. I need to clean my room. It is getting a bit messy. But, yeah, it also stinks in here because I keep eating my food in here. 
So I just keep spraying the Febreze like on my bed and stuff. But yeah, just chilling, watching Emma Stacey. I actually do have a lecture. It is, what's the time? It's 20 past one and I have my lecture again at two, two till four, long day. Long day. And then me and Liv are gonna go to the post office and I wanna pop to Aldi to get some tin foil or cling film. That's about it really. Also, I got my student loan. Uh, which is good. I'm currently fucking my tea. So I'm, uh, that's the most million thing ever, sorry. I'm having chicken, like a chicken pajita with potatoes. So I'm gonna fry chicken off with some pepper. Put some, I've got some chips in the oven, like I made some chips. Got some cucumber on the side, which I cut up. Um, I'm gonna have it with some ketchup. Sorry, but how good does my dinner look? absolutely 10 out chicken of 10. chicken did take forever to cook but it's finally done so delicious so that is you have to ignore my clustered lashes i really need to brush them through but anyway that is the end of the vlog this is me editing it and yeah it's kind of a really weird mishap vlog like there's so much happening in one but it was just my first week at uni and then i went home after that for the weekend um which has been nice i'm gonna try and do some more vlogs and more videos so let me know what videos you'd like to see and yeah i hope you've like enjoyed the little reality of just starting uni all fresh scary big things but yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next video